In this lab demo, we're the JIRA administrator at Teams in Space, and we're ready to start implementing the business requirements on our JIRA site. We'll go to our site URL and log in as the JIRA administrator, Dakota Jones. Don't log in with Google or Microsoft. On the onboarding screens, we'll simply skip the questions. Once you're logged into JIRA, bookmark the page to save you time later when logging in as other users. First, we'll create the project that's going to be used as the standard project for all development projects going forward. We'll select Projects, Create Project. We're going to use a Scrum project so we can leave this template. We'll call it Rocketeers App. And we'll change the key to dev. We're going to use dev as the key for this project to identify it as the standard development project. All the schemes created for this project will have dev as their prefix and so will be easy to identify. Let's click create. Now we'll update the project details. We'll go to project settings. And on the details page, we'll change the avatar. We'll use this rocket and we'll enter a description. For the project lead, we'll use Sophie. She's the Scrum Master. We'll leave the default assignee as unassigned and save the details. And we'll close this dialogue here. Now let's go to the summary page and view the project schemes. Here you can see the issue type scheme, the workflow scheme, the screen scheme, and the issue type screen scheme were created specifically for this project. Whereas the permission and notification schemes and field configurations are default schemes and are shared. In the following labs, we'll be customizing these dev schemes and creating new dev schemes from the defaults so we'll have a set of schemes to apply to all new development projects going forward.